Okay, well, I'm gonna, this is gonna be, this is, I'm not gonna get this on one take. All right, inheritance, ugh, well, there we go. See, promised. I think that, you know, one of the things that I wrote this play about was, was feeling a sense of isolation. I think a lot of the characters in the play feel isolated. I think a lot of people right now feel a sense of isolation, and you don't have to be an LGBTQ individual to, to feel that. Theater has the power to change your life right there in the very moment. Everyone's sitting in that room. Things are happening sometimes for the first time right now, and that doesn't happen in any other medium. And this was the first play I read that was about young gay men and older gay men and about just human beings in general that was written by somebody who was much younger than I am. And to see their perspective was really life-changing. Like, it made me think, oh, there's hope. There's hope for the theater, there's hope for young people <laughs> in a really crazy, messed up world. It's about being able to feel things, being able to face your fears head on. You know, utilize them, use them, make yourself a richer person through them. The people that this show is reaching, who share their stories at stage four, whether they lived through the AIDS crisis, whether they lost all of their friends, whether they weren't affected by it at all, they've been massively moved and changed by the experience of this piece of theater. This is one of those life changers because of the depth and human complexity of its stories. It's really quite an amazing piece of writing where the stories are so whole and varied and funny and sad and many things at once. Why not disconnect for a moment and come gather with a thousand other people and experience something. It can be a vacation and a time to check in with yourself and the, the world around you. We live in a very scary time right now and this play offers some levity in that. I think it offers also some perspectives that people might not be thinking about. We're questioning the truth, and I think this play presents the truth in, in a way that is easy to comprehend, but also challenges you to think outside the box a little more.